pinaghiwang natin ang isang daang taon ng aparisyon sa Fatima, no? ay makita po natin ay na kung saan ay ano, ay bahagi po ng pagkilos na uh, yun yung laman ng kanyang minsay sa Fatima. Lumapit kayo kay Jesus. Lumapit kayo sa mahal na puso na Jesus. At kayo ay bibigyan niya ng tunay na kaginawa. Yan ang pinahayag na yun yung mahal na mahal na Bering Maria ng Fatima. No? So yung sabihin, si Masi, ang mahal na Bering Maria ng Fatima at ang, ang, ang pagkakilala natin at iba't ibang mga pangalan ay binibigyan natin. Ay alin, tumutukoy na alin. Gawin natin yung utos na Yesus. Yung Marawi incident, alam mo yung nakakalungkot, na inatake at sinunog yung katedral sa Marawi. At alam niyo yung pangalan ng katedral sa Marawi? Mary help our Christians. The church was born, born, sinunog sa kapistahan ng mahal na Bering Maria, ang mapagampon ng mga Kristiyano. So bakit? Natatakot sila kay Maria eh. Natatakot sila kay Maria. Sa mga nakita nila yung lakas na ipinamamanig kung paano si Maria no, ay kahit na sa mga Muslim kasi si Maria kasi ay pinaralangan din daw ng, Muslim, ng mga Muslim ang tawag ko sa kanila yun eh, si Miriam no, sa mga Muslim. Kaya kapag kilala nila si Maria Miriam ang tawag nila sa kay, kay Maria. No? So, bahagi ho. Kasi si Maria ay isa sa mga naging dahilang kung bakit may mga mananampalataya kay Jesus. No? Kaya maraming salamat po no? sa panahon na ito ng ating pag-alagi. Nais ko rin po magpasalamat sa lahat ng mga sponsors na ating pong pagdiriwang mula May 1 hanggang sa May 31. Hanggang May 31 po tayo mag-aalay ng bulaklak sa mahal na Bering Maria. No? Isa po ang pagkapasalamat na kung saan ay pinamanig natin. Sabi nga po natin, eh, makita natin kasi ito yung image ng nanay. No? Ipanalangin din rin nyo. Alimbawa, mayroon kayong mga mga tao na na kung tawagin natin yung pasaway. Ah, Idulog natin sa mahal na Bering Maria no? for the conversion of their souls. Kasi napakalapit po ang mahal na Bering Maria. Isa sa mga bagay na konstitusin po ay makita po natin. No? Isa rin po ang halimbawa rito. No? No, pinag-usapan po yung yung pinalis, yung rosaryo no? sa mga sa, sa mga sa mga sasakyan, marami ang nag-react. No? Marami ang nag-react. Kaya ngayon, suspended. Suspended ngayon yung batas. No? So, first time ko na makita na masuspend ang isang batas. No? So, isa ako doon sa nag-anoy ka, bakit? Kasi pati yung usaryo pinaalis. No? Pero yun, na, makita po natin. Isang modelo na huwag natin kalimutan para may isa katuparan natin yung misyon na ibinigay sa atin alin. Make disciples of all nations alin. Hilingin natin ang tulong ng mahal na Berhen Maria.
Please, our eyes. I believe in one God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and of visible and invisible. I believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, born of the Father before all ages, God from God, light from light, through God from true God, begotten and not made, consubstantial with the Father. For him all things were made for us for us more and for us he came down from heaven and by the Holy Spirit was incarnate of the Virgin Mary and he became man. For our sake, he was crucified under Pontius Pilate, he suffered death and was buried, and rose again on the third day, in accordance with the scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father and the Son, who with the Father and the Son is adored and glorified, who has spoken to the prophets. I believe in one holy Catholic and apostolic church. I confess my baptism for the forgiveness of sins, and I look forward to the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Amen. Jesus Christ lives forever and is seated at the right hand of the Father. Through Him we pray to the Father for the needs of the church and say, Lord of glory, hear our prayer. Lord of glory, hear our prayer. That the church may continue to proclaim the message of Christ through the fastest and most effective means we pray lord of glory hear our prayer that our spiritual and civil leaders may foster mutual respect and always engage in dialogue for the benefit of the people they serve we pray lord of lord glory, glory hear our prayer that the communications media may seek and contribute constructively to the propagation of all that is good and true, we pray. Lord of glory, hear our prayer. That media practitioners may always foster the accurate reporting of events, full explanation of matters of public concern, and fair representation of diverse point of view, we pray. Lord of glory, hear our prayer. That all of us gathered here may have the courage to proclaim the gospel by word, prayer, and good example, we pray. Lord of glory, hear our prayer. Lord God, your Son goes back to you to share your glory. Our eyes can no longer see him, but we see him with the eyes of faith and continue to love him. Make us serve him by bringing the good news to the men and women of today, especially through the communication media. We ask this through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Please be seated.
pray, brethren, to our sacrifice and be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice of your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His church. We offer our sacrifice now in supplication of Lord, O Lord, to honor the wondrous ascension of your Son. Grant, we pray, that through His most holy exchange, we too may rise out to the heavenly realms. Through Christ our Lord, Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit, give up your hearts. Lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly totally right and just, our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty, Eternal God. For the Lord Jesus, the King of glory, conqueror of sin and death, ascended today to the highest Sabbath, as the angels gaze in wonder. Mediator between God and man, judge of the world and Lord of us, he ascended not to distance himself from our lowly state, but that we, his members might be confident of following where he, our head and founder, has gone before. Therefore, overcome with Paschal joy, every land, every people, exalts in your praise and even to the heavenly powers with the angelic hosts and together the unending hymn of your glory as they acclaim. and make them holy and you never cease to gather people to yourself so that from the rising of the sun to its setting up your sacrifice will be offered to your name therefore O Lord we humbly implore you by the same spirit graciously make all these gifts we have brought to you for consecration that they may become the body and blood of your son O Lord Jesus Christ at his command we celebrate these mysteries for in the night he was betrayed he himself took bread and giving you thanks, he said the blessing, broke the bread, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this all of you and eat of it. This is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was said that he took the chalice and giving you thanks, he said the blessing, gave the cup to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. This is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and everlasting covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me.
da mistere ao Pai. of your Son's wondrous resurrection and ascension into heaven. And as we look forward to his second coming, we offer you in thanksgiving his holy and living sacrifice. Look, we pray upon the oblation of your church and recognizing the sacrificial victim by whose death you will to reconcile us to your Son. Grant that we who are nourished by the body and blood of your Son and filled with the Holy Spirit may become one body, one spirit in Christ may make of us an eternal offering to you, so that we may obtain inheritance with your elect, especially with the most blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Saint Joseph, her spouse, with your blessed apostles and glorious martyrs, with Saint Martin, and with all the saints that is constant intercession in your presence, your life for unfailing help. May this sacrifice of our reconciliation, we pray, O Lord, advance the peace and salvation of all the world. Be pleased to confirm in faith and charity your pilgrim church on earth with your servant Francis Benaventura, the order of bishops, all the clergy, and the entire people you have gained for your own. Listen graciously to the prayers of his family, whom you have summoned before you in the compassion, in your compassion, O merciful Father, gather to yourself all your children scattered throughout the world. To our departed brothers and sisters, and to all who are pleasing to you, as they are passing from this life, give kind admittance to your kingdom, that we hope to enjoy forever the fullness of your glory. Through Christ our Lord, through whom you bestow on the world all that is good. Through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty, Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, our glory and honors is yours forever and ever. fulfill the mission that Christ has given us to make disciples of all nations.
Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days. And with the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress. As we wait, await the blessed hope in the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Peace I give you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant our peace in unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. of the world. Happy are those who are called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I'm not worthy that you should under, enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed.
Christ of Giver of Life, we leave our hearts and voices to you. Help us to build a society that truly chosen life in all situations. Let our response be, Lord, hear our pain. For those experiencing pain and anguish because of the violence and crime, response. For perpetrator and victim of a types who both struggle, anger, and hatred, response. For our broken world, enchained by the desire of revenge, response. For our wounded society, missile by the illusion that one must take life in order to defend it, response. Let us say together, help us to make peace. For our country, tempted to accept violence and revenge, response. For the conviction to recognize the uphold and dignity of all people, response. For the wisdom to see poverty, injustice, and lack of educational and employment opportunities as likely causes of criminality, response. For guidance and compassion in addressing the pain of both victims and the perpetrator of wrongdoing, response. Help us to make peace. For the fortitude to find solution that protect the dignity of all people and bring about the reconciliation, response. Help us to make For the inspiration to renew society on the basis of love and restoration, restorative justice, response. Let us pray. Father of compassion, you let your painful to the just and the unjust. Give us heart like yours so that we may love as you love, even those who have caused by pain. This is our land, a cry for vengeance and a move to fulfill up death, raw and kill offenders. But this thing this disguise as a call for justice. Let your lasting justice spring forth. Jesus, our brother, you suffered execution in the hand of the powerful, but you did not let hatred overcome to you. Help us to reach our victim of violence so that our enduring love may help heal their wounds. Holy Spirit, Lord and giver of life, you're strengthening us the struggle for justice. Help us to work tirelessly against state sanction death and to renew society in truth, justice, and love and respect so that violence will quickly cease and peace may prevail. Amen. O Mary, Mother of Life, protect the Filipino people from the forces of death. San Lorenzo Ruiz. San Pedro Calunso, Saint Paul the First Hermit, Saint Martin the Poorest, the healer of the sick. Almighty ever living God who allow those on earth to celebrate divine mysteries. Grant, we pray, the Christians who may draw us onward to where our nature is united with you. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated for some announcements. So, uh, ang ating po mga seminarista, no, mayroon tayong tatlong seminarista na tumulong sa atin sa loob po na nakalipas na isang buwan. So sila po ay uuwi na. Kasi one month lang yung kanilang apostolate. So nagpapasalamat tayo no? sa tatlo natin seminarista na sina Brother uh, Ibarra, 
Emang at saka si Moja. Sila po ay magti-third year philosophy you know, this coming school year. So, uh, ang ating mga magawa salamat ay yung patuloy nating panalangin para sa kanila. No? Sama na rin yung natin yung dalawa nating seminarista no? na si Brother Louie no? at saka si Brother Paolo babalik na uli sa seminaryo. No? Si Brother Paolo ay na maingayan dalawang taon. So kayo ni babalik na uli. No? So panalangin po natin ito itong mga uh, limang Seminarista natin, yung mga seminarista na naging bahagi din po natin ng mga nakalipas na taon. So, yung ating dalawang seminarista, nagpapasalamat tayo. Kasi noon, tatlo yan. Dalawa na lang ngayon. Sana ay magpatuloy sila. Maging mga pari, katulad ng pinahayag natin sa Ebanghelyo. Upang sila ay tunay na makatugon full time full time to make disciples of all nations. So, kaya po, panalangin natin sila. No? Huwag niyong kalimutan ang patuloy na panalangin para sa ating mga nagpapari. Pangalawa, ay yung pong ating flooring. No? Masalama, patuloy natin yung panalangin para po sa mga masayos ng ating flooring. Pangatlo, yung po ating mga, sabi nga po, yung ating mga sagala ngayon na, uh, na nakaisa para sa pagkaparangal natin sa mahal na berhen ng Maria, ang berhen ng mga bulaklak. No? So, nasaan po ang mga taga-holiday homes, mga taga-representative ng holiday homes, yung mga sagala ng holiday homes, ta tayo, tayo. Sa gala ng Holiday Homes, tayo yung sa gala ng Holiday Homes, nag-iisa na lang. Pakiharap po rito sa harapan. Punta pa kayo sa harapan nang makita kayo ng madlang people. Sige po. So, ayan ang ating taga Holiday Homes. Ang mga... Taga... Labit... Ah, taas pa na eh. Taas pa, taas pa. Holiday Homes din yan? Yes, Papa. Oh, sige. Adelina 1A. Nasaan ang Adelina 1A? Lapit po, mga Tagalini 1A. Mga Tagalina 1A. Ang mga taga Elnor Homes. Mayroon pa ang representative sa Elnor Homes? Wala na sa Elnor Homes. Sa, yun. Okay. Si Nene. Yung buong mga taga Fiesta Homes. Nawala na yung Fiesta Homes. Yung buong sa Adelina 1B. Adelina 1B. Sino nga sa Adelina 1B? Wala. Yung mga taga Adelina 1. Asa yung mga taga Adelina 1? Mga uh, taga Adelina 1. Every, every year yung kasi ngayon umiikot. No? Umiikot po kasi every year. So ang host natin ngayon ay mga taga Carmen Homes. Asa na mga taga Carmen Homes? Ah, magsilapit po kayo rito. Ayan po yung ating mga taga Carmen Homes. Ha? So maraming salamat po sa inyo. Huwag na kayo maalis dyan ha. Kasi pagkatapos ng ating final blessing, ay meron pa ba akong, meron pa ba akong hindi pa nababanggit? Na mga, o yung ating mga angels. Asa yung mga angels? Yung mga angels. Eh yun, yun. Bunta kayo rin. Sama na rin kayo dyan. Punta kayo sa harapan. Ayan. 
yung mga angels natin. So pagkatapos mo ng final blessing, ay magkasalbi Regina po tayo. No? So magkasalbi Regina natin, ay tayo ay pagkatapos ng salbi Regina and then yung recessional hymn, yung recessional hymn, tsaka po tayo magkaroon ng isang picture taking. No? Let us all stand. Mga nene, alam kayo rito, dito muna kayo marap. Mga dalaga. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May the Almighty God bless you all. The Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go with the joy of the Christ ascended into heaven. Thanks be to God. Sorry. Maria Purisima. 